Hello, future designers and developers. This is our video tutorial over HTML basics, paragraphs. Paragraphs is the most common text that you'll find on a web page. You can think about it as the standard text found inside of a book or inside of a newspaper. It's the most common text that we see displayed and it should be our most readable, just easy on the eyes, keep on reading this, a fairly small text. So let's get started. Uh, this one again is inside standard one we've got a video tutorial on it which you are watching right now and then we have our instructions over here so this one we are building on to our last one which was on headings so we're going to be using our h2 tag to write the actual question and then we're going to write our response inside of a paragraph so let's get started I'm gonna go back into that same one this is the same file that I've been using since hello world so should be pretty simple for you. All right, what I am going to do is I'm going to start with that H2 tag and write that first question in here. So that first question is, what is your favorite class so far? So what is your favorite uh, class so far? Cool. So. Like I did before, I'm using my H2. So I have my opening and closing bracket. I've got my opening tag up here, my closing tag down here that is auto-populated by glitch. Now this is the first time that we're gonna be using a paragraph. So I'm gonna go right after this H2 and I'm going to do that opening, then use P and then close it up. So the P tag right there, that is our paragraph tag. And you're gonna see that this is a smaller font, smaller text, and that's what we're gonna be using to answer these classes. Oh, and I missed an S up there, cool. Cool. So I'm gonna say that my favorite class is web development. Web development, easy peasy. Then I'm gonna go on to the next H2. We're gonna open that one up and let's take a look. Uh, what makes this your favorite class? Cool. And I'm gonna go and ask that. What makes this your favorite class? Again, after that H2, I'm going to hit enter and I'm gonna grab another paragraph tag. So now we're inside of that paragraph element. And I'm gonna say, I love the combination of coding and design. I truly do. When we get further into this class, we are going to truly see how we can write code that influences design greatly. And that's gonna be more when we get into CSS, which is coming up very quickly. So there we go. We've got that answered. Um, and I'm not gonna show you any more but we're gonna go over the other questions. So I want you to answer what technologies do teachers use that you like? If these are things like you enjoy doing flip grids or you really enjoy submitting things on Canvas or you like getting reminds from that Remind 101 app, uh, if that helps, please let me know. This is feedback that I wanna know to make this class better. So it's feedback for me as well as it's practice for you to learn more about web development. And also at the same time, number four is what technologies do teachers use that you dislike. If you really dislike Flipgrids, let me know. I wanna make sure that you're using technologies that you find exciting inside of this class. And the last thing is what's something that you're most excited for for in-person classes. So please share that information with me. I'm very excited to read your responses and that's it. I will talk to you later. Peace out.